And second point. And today we're going to have... Eagle. Rare. Single barrel select. Which is nice. Right after this. can join the army of the whiskey poppers we are selling some t-shirts and a few lucky people will be actually gifted that's right so right now what we need you guys to do is like our videos subscribe to our channel if you haven't already and then share that video with hashtag whiskey pop we will add you into a drawing to win one of the free shirts. In a few weeks, we will draw names for our winners. That's right. So we're gonna try to give away 10 shirts. So there's a lot of opportunity here for you to win a shirt. So remember, like, subscribe, subscribe and, share. and share with two people. Make sure you put the hashtag whiskey pop in there and we will add you into the drawing for a free shirt. Yep. So Jeffrey, I hear we're having Eagle Rare today. That's second right. Pour. Second pour Eagle Rare today. So let's, Open up this bottle. Oh, we must, for sure. <sighs> Movie magic. Now, we have had a little bit of this. Now, uh, I would be honest, this bottle has been sitting around for a while. This this has? Uh, a couple of years. <laughs> Did I say a couple of years? I, if you get to know somebody and you find out they've been holding out on you on all kinds of things. Not all kinds of things, it's just Eagle Rare. Okay, so we've had Eagle Rare before, yes. but this is a single barrel select. And earlier this week, we did a Eagle Rare Blanton's Buffalo Trace single barrel blind. Yeah, to see the family the show off. If you want to see that, you can watch that. Yes. But now I think today we're going to try this one, right? I say we do that. Let's sniff this baby. And that was excessively sniffing. This is my ASMR. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna whisper everything we're gonna out for your alpha We will whisper. We want you to for it. be able to realize how yeah. good this whiskey is yeah. with our whisper voice. I think this is the longest I've ever whispered in my life. <laughs> we can talk louder, but still use the whisper voice. Oh yeah, like this. Did you see the spit that just <laughs> flew out of my mouth? Yeah, no, it's it. But I'm gonna sniff this whiskey. <laughs> <sighs> okay, so. I get an immediate toffee caramel right on the nose. Well, I definitely get the, uh, I still say it's like that apple fruity because of the- Oh yeah, for sure. Yeah. Yeah, and now we can, what we're gonna have to do today is because I don't know what the tasting notes were specified that they were picking up when they picked the barrel. Oh, right, because it's a barrel. So we'll barrel use our barrel. standards of this is what it usually is and we'll see if we're picking some new stuff out of this that Maybe they're not listing in Eagle Rares. Yeah, I'm getting a lot more fruit than a regular Eagle Rare. That's I, I will say that I the say. floral note that I normally smell in the Eagle Rare is still there. You know, like some blossom, like, and, and you know, normally I usually get a lot of eucalyptus with Eagle Rare. Uh, and it's, it's, I'm not kicking that up this it's time. It's got like a high alcohol, uh, high alcohol. Alcohol, alcohol. And it's got a high alcohol kind of a <laughs> smell to it. He thinks I'm gonna cut that. <laughs> And it sort of has this high alcohol kind of a smell to it. I don't, I mean, maybe. I mean, it's really sweet. So the nose is really sweet. Yeah, I'm not saying that's bad. Yeah. All right, let's go in on this. All right. Oh, now, before you tell me what you taste, let's talk about the nose. Yeah. The nose generally for Eagle Rare is toffee, hints of orange peel, herb, not herb, but herb. Herb, herb, herb yeah. is your next door neighbor. Yeah. Honey, leather, and oak. Yeah, I I can see the honey and, yeah. the, and the herb if that's yeah. what they're gonna be guessing for the floral side of it. Mm -hmm. But again, the nose, I'm still picking up some sort of a fruit, almost an apple, but yeah. could that be just this bottle? It, I think it could be that bottle. I, mean, I am getting the apple that we're talking about. Now, now oh. taste wise. Taste it, try that again. Yeah. Caramel. But lots of caramel, right? Toffee caramel. Um, the oak is really subdued. Yeah, and I get a spice. I get almost like a rye spice almost out of this. Now, an Eagle Rare is, a, is an aged 10-year whiskey. 
So, I mean, for me, I would think you would think the tannin of the oak and stuff would be pretty, pretty yeah, heavy yeah, on that. It's, it's not. It's got a lot of chew to the back, and I can get the almost a almost like a hot chocolate kind of flavor in the back of the mouth a little bit. Let's talk about it. so. No, generally, the palate on this is bold, dry, oaky flavors with candied almonds and cocoa. I'm not getting cocoa on this. Yeah, I'm, I'm picking up that actually. You're getting the cocoa? I actually am getting the cocoa. Now, I am getting leather still. Like in the chew. Yeah, so. I mean, this is a technical term. Sometimes you gotta chew your whiskey. And not necessarily like that, but <laughs> you know. Now, I am still getting the leather, even in the palate. So, and maybe, maybe a little. Maybe like a drizzle of honey. You know, the honey's not like strong. It's just like, it's just like if you had leftover on something. I'm getting definitely a cocoa. Pretty strong cocoa? I'm, I'm saying like hot chocolate cocoa, not like, you know. Now, I mean, now you're talking about it, I can pick it up because I'm thinking about it more yeah. and what cocoa smells like and stuff. Yeah, no, it's in there. Like the, the, the to me though, it's more of the dry Hershey cocoa, the baking cocoa. Mm -hmm. Like, you know, when you go scoop the powdered cocoa out of like the Hershey's cocoa baking. Okay, well. That's what I feel like. It's more that than it is like just chocolate, milk chocolate, dark chocolate. All right, so now the finish on this, they say the finish on this should be dry and lingering. Definitely dry. Yeah, it's definitely dry. And I, like I said, I, I, I would agree with the lingering only because that's where all these flavors that I'm picking up are at the like at a back but end. To me, I think it's a it's a medium linger. It's not a long linger. No, it, it's 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 really it's not quick, but it's still pretty fast and enough to where you could have to drink some more. Well, and since that's not a problem, that's not a problem. Now, uh, I will say this is drinking a lot different than just your run of the mill, if there is such a thing. Uh, Eagle Rare. Eagle Rare. Now, I mean, Eagle Rare is one of those whiskeys that a lot of a lot of new whiskey drinkers chase. Uh, mainly because it's so hard to find. And I mean, it's funny that it has the name rare in it and it actually is kind of yeah. rare. No, I I actually, this is one of the better bottles I've had of this. I think it has enough differences and nuance in it that it really is exciting for the palate. I'm getting cookie. That's the cocoa. I'm, I get, I'm, I'm getting a little bit of cookie. So like the fresh baked cookies. Yeah, that, that like a chocolate chip cookie. Yeah, yeah. That's the cocoa. Yeah, for sure. Now I'm getting that as it kind of sits and you try it a little bit more. Mm -hmm. No, man, <laughs> this is good. Yeah, There's no right. doubt this is good. Well, let's see how good. Let's rate this. All right. All right. So again. Five finger. Yeah. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, and cinco. Yeah, you gotta get up to cinco. Cinco. Now, Since have we started. rated very many cincos yet? No, nah, we haven't. Yeah, it's true, we haven't. No, we haven't rated a bunch of them. Um, and again, lots of times we change up our rating for our personal ideas of like what we're trying to do here. Yeah, in this case here, I'm gonna just compare this straight up to what it is. Now I know it's a single barrel. The mm -hmm. chance of us probably getting the exact same flavor again is zero. Is pretty low. But once again, normally they'll probably blend these into their own barrels to get that Eagle Rare flavor. It's still kind of in that Eagle Rare. Are you going first or am I going first? I'm going first. Okay, let's do it. Uh, I think this is really good. Yeah, I do too. It's really it's good. It's not a five? No. But I may give this, I want to give it a 0.5 for once. Well, I mean. I'm trying to stay away from that, but I'm going to say 4.5. Yeah, it's a four finger for me. It's yeah. solid. It's uh, yeah. This is a really good bottle. <laughs> I mean, it sounds um, it sounds funny since we're in the middle of summer, but I'm like, I want to curl up with a fireplace and sit here and yeah. sip this. The unfortunate thing is, like I said, there's no more of those. I had two, we drank one. A long time ago. <laughs> yeah, now, pre pandemic. There was there was a it. time when actually Eagle Rare was easy to get. Yeah, it's funny. I, most of the stores I walk into, I never see it on the shelf. No, it's not. It's I not usually have show. to find out if they have any, and, and sure enough, normally they will pull it out from behind the counter. But even then, I hear a lot of, "Oh, we haven't seen that in months." Yeah, I'm like, "What do you see?" Now the question is, are you picking up? Uh, bottles of Eagle Rare. Do you see it? Do you uh, do you try to find it? Have you had a bottle, or is this something you've never seen around? Yeah, I mean, we we all have our unicorns we chase. I stopped chasing this one because it's yeah. just 
I'll find other stuff. I didn't. But. I didn't chase this bottle. I think you know. I got a call and said, "Hey, they've got a barrel over here at this oh, place." Yeah. I'm like, "I'm gonna go buy." It. I mean, of course, I'm gonna go and get it. Yeah, well, sure. But I didn't wait in line for it or anything. We just walked in, pulled it, and honestly, I think it sat around. This, believe it or not, when I bought it, which was about two years ago, it they had it in stock for a good week. Wow. Because I went. That's I not how it goes today. I, huh? didn't, I didn't go the day they opened it. Yeah. And so it, it, I think it lasted for about a week, which yeah. nowadays, you know as well as I do, this is a two hours or less. Mm -hmm. It's gone. Well, I mean, as we're sitting here, I mean, it is opening up. Yeah. It's becoming more desserty flavored. Um, wow, that is really good. Yeah. So, you know what, guys? Go grab you some bottle of Eagle Rare. Uh, or, you know what? Maybe, uh, maybe you won't. <laughs> maybe you just can't. Maybe you just can't. But in the meantime, you guys continue to be cool this week. And uh, have a good weekend. Yep. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers.